Today, I'm gonna be ranking every single monster in Roblox doors from best to worst. What is going on, TFG Squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome back to another tier list. Today, we're gonna be doing Roblox doors. These are all the monsters from the original game and the brand new update that just came out. Let's get started. So, monster number one is the one that probably attacks you the most in Roblox doors. His name is Rush. Basically, you start hearing a creepy sound coming behind you. You have to jump in one of the closets, and he barges through the door and turns off all the lights, which I never really like. Oh, oh, by the way, I gotta change the names. You guys know I never go with, like, A, B, C, D. So we're gonna go number one is Yee... Ha. I don't know if I've ever done that before. All right, number two is gonna be, um, Yes Sir. Okay, uh, B is gonna be, uh, Meh. Uh, the, the plus, right? It's not just meh. Meh makes it sound bad. It's meh plus. The second worst one is gonna be called can't, uh, talk, uh, new phone. I, I don't even know what that means. Is that a good thing? Is that a bad thing? I don't know. I come up with these names literally right off the top of my head. And the last one is gonna be, um, no, no, it's it's just gonna be uh, actually you know what I'm gonna make this a little bit better. No period. All right, so where are we gonna put Rush? I, I kind of uh, I don't mind Rush. Rush is easy to get past. I've gotten used to him. I even kind of like him because he is from the you know the original Roblox Doors game, probably the first monster that I ever died to. I don't think I'm gonna put him all the way up in Yeehaw though. I'm gonna put him in Yes Sir. So he's pretty good. One of my favorites. Again, these aren't the scariest monsters. These aren't the the most uh, difficult monsters. These are just my favorites and my least favorites. Play along with me, by the way. Let me know if you agree. If you disagree, let me know which ones are your favorites in the comments below. Also, if you want to see more tier lists on the channel, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel right now. Monster number two. We're going with Timothy. Honestly, out of all the monsters in this game... Timothy is probably the one that scares me the most because it's so unexpected. I'm usually looking through cabinets and closets, hoping to find like batteries or band-aids or coins. And then Timothy just pops out at me, usually like once or twice a video and just scares me so much. So you know what? But I kind of like Timothy. I mean, it's such an unexpected name for a spider, uh, especially for a spider in a horror game. You're expecting something scary and his name's just Timothy. It's like a nice, lovely name. So where are we going to put Timothy? I'm going to buy... I kind of want to put him in Yeehaw. He's definitely not... No, he's definitely not can't talk right now. He's definitely not meh plus. You know what? I'm going to put him in Yes Sir. But I'm going to put him above Rush. So if you guys don't know how I do my tier lists, left to right is higher. Let's move on to monster number three. We're going with another classic. His name is Eyes, which is kind of ironic because you can't put your eyes on him or else you die. I remember the first time I died to Rush, or not Rush, the first time I died to Eyes, I had no idea what to do, so I kept staring at him, which is like... Literally the only thing you can't do when eyes comes after you. So where am I gonna put eyes? I like eyes. I think he's colorful I think he makes the room look really fun and purpley, but I think I'm gonna put him I think I'm gonna put him at Matt plus. I like him. I think he's cool. He's a classic but I'm not going to put him up with Timothy and Rush. Those guys are just too big of classics for me. We're taking a quick pause on the classic monsters. We're going for some of the new ones. So the first one right here is A60. So he kind of starts showing up right around door 60, which is why he's called A60. You hear a little bit of static. He's very similar to Rush, and you have to hide before he attacks you. Uh, I think I'm going to put him... I mean, I don't dislike him. I don't dislike him. I don't know if I'm going to put him in, like, can't talk. I'm going to put him in meh, but he's way behind eyes. Like, he is definitely a, he's almost like a meh minus, but there's not a category for meh minus. After that, we've got A90. Honestly, he might be the second scariest monster, especially when him and A60 attack you at the same time. So basically, A90 just pops up on your screen, and you can't move. And if you move, it turns red, and then he attacks you and basically destroys you. I'm gonna put him on can't talk new phone. I don't, again, I don't really know what 
what that category means, but it's what I'm gonna go with. Moving on to A, I, I believe it's, is it A120? Yeah, I think it's A120. So this is kind of the last main monster in the secret doors off to the right. He's very similar to Ambush, right? Where he kind of comes behind and then he could keep coming back and forth a couple times. So you have to stay in the closet. He's not as hard as Ambush though, because in rooms, you can hide in the, in the lockers as long as you want. Whereas in Roblox doors, you can only hide in the closet for so much time and then you start getting attacked. So I'm going to put him, I'm going to put him, you know what? I think he's a little bit cooler than A90. I'm gonna put him in Can't Talk New Phone. Appropriately so, the next monster is Ambush. He's from the original game. He's the one that kind of comes behind you, but then comes back, just like A120. But the reason why he's a little bit cooler is one, he's more colorful. He makes the whole room kind of a greenish color. And also, he's a lot more difficult to beat because like I said, when you hear him coming, you can't just hide in the closet. You kind of have to like, Go in the closet, wait for him to pass, go out of the closet, go back in the closet. It's it's a little bit more tricky to beat him. So I'm going to put him up. I'm going to put him on meh plus. I'm going to put him... You know what? He's going to be my top meh plus. Oh, next up we've got El Goblino. I think his name's El Goblino. I hope I said that right. Basically, this is the guy... Uh, he's in the new update. He's at room 52, I believe, where there's, like, Jeff's shop off to the right or the left, and you've got Bob, which is, uh, sitting right next to El Goblino. I like El Goblino. He doesn't attack me. He's nice. He says some funny things every once in a while. You know what? I'm putting El Goblino up at yes, sir. He's gonna be behind Timothy and Rush. But I like El Goblino. I think he's fun. He's cool. He's colorful. He's witty. He's a fun one. I like him. Next, we've got Bob. Bob is the skeleton in the same room, number 52, that just sits there, doesn't really talk very much, actually doesn't say anything at all. I thought he was going to jump scare me at one point, and then he just said nothing. I'm going to put him behind El Goblino. I'm going to put Bob in meh plus... He's going to be behind Ambush, but ahead of Eyes. That's pretty high. Some of you guys might be like, Brandon, we like Bob. So do I. I like Bob. I think he's funny, even though he doesn't say anything. But I can't put him up. I can't put him above Ambush. Oh, man. My nemesis. Next, we have Dupe. So Dupe is once again in the new update. Now they have it so that you go to certain rooms and there's two doors. And if you pick the wrong one, dupe attacks you. And, and, and you guys know me. I never pay attention. I never know what room we're in. And I get attacked by dupe every single time and my health goes down. So here we go. It's a love-hate with dupe. I think dupe is a really cool addition. Like, I think it's a great updated monster and made the game a lot more fun. But again, he also kills me every single time. So I, I'm going to put him right behind El Goblino in Yes Sir. Yep, yep, yep. I did it. I did it. I put him up in Yes Sir. Next up, I have the guy called Glitch. Now, I've played a lot of Roblox doors. I don't think I've ever gotten the Glitch. I did a little research and I looked up what he does. Apparently, before the update... He kills you and you lose all of your progress instantly. It's like a very rare thing to get in the game. But now they update it. So if, if you get glitch, he teleports you to a random room. I'm going to put him in can't talk new phone. But that's only because I've never had to deal with him. So let me know if you think Glitch should be higher or lower. Next up, we've got another monster that I don't know a lot about. This guy's name is Halt. Now, I got attacked by Halt one time eh, ever in my experience in Roblox doors. And I just didn't know what to do and died immediately. So I, unlike Glitch, I have experienced Halt but I didn't learn anything from him because I just died immediately and I probably exited the game. I didn't read the description when Roblox Stores tells you what to do. So let's put... Ugh, I'm going to put him above Glitch because I have dealt with him, but I'm still going to keep him in Can't Talk New Phone. Next up, we've got Jack. Now, I think Jack is the guy that uh, he attacks you when you're in room 50 a lot of times when you jump in one of the cabinets to hide. Every once in a while, it's like a 1 in 2,000 chance you'll get jump scared. Now, nothing happens. You don't take any damage, but it's really scary. He's probably... 
he might be scarier than Timothy, actually. When he attacks you, because it's so unexpected and it's so loud, it really scares you. I've gotten attacked by Jack, like, maybe one or two times. I'm gonna put him above A60, but behind eyes. After that, we've got Jeff. So, Jeff is the guy that runs the shop in room 52, right after you beat the figure. A and you could buy, like, the crucifix, you could buy the skeleton key, I think you could buy, like, a lockpick, a couple things from him. I love Jeff. I think Jeff is great. Now, I've never made Jeff angry. This is like an angry version of Jeff, apparently. I don't know. Some some of you guys told me to turn off the radio and he'll get evil and kill you, but I've never experienced that. I, I, so I like him. I'm going to put him... He's going to go up in Yes Sir. He's going to be behind Timothy, Rush, and El Goblino, but he's going to be above Duke. And that leaves us with three monsters left, and they are three of the most classic monsters in Roblox doors. Let's start with Screech. This is the guy that makes that little whisper sound in your ear. It sounds like, psst, and, and then you got to look around and find him before he jump scares you. He, he really creeps me out. I don't know if I would call him the scariest monster, but he's the monster that gives me, like, goosebumps on the back of my neck. I like him. I like Screech. Uh, well, I actually don't like him. I can't stand him, but I also do like him. I'm putting him up in yee-haw. Putting him up in yee- Actually, no, no, I changed my mind. I'm, I changed my mind. I'm putting him behind Timothy. I think, you know what? Timothy goes up in yee-haw. Actually, you know what? Screech is going up in yee-haw too. So that's, <laughs> I just made a lot of major changes, by the way. I hope all of you guys are sitting down with your seat belts on. I'm going to put Screech as my number two behind Timothy. Next up, we've got Seek. So Seek is the guy that chases you through the halls and you have to go in the right doors or also kill you. I am like weirdly good at Seek. I don't know, like, Sam is a much better uh, Roblox Doors player than I am, but I'm better uh, at getting away from Seek than she is. Like, I rarely, maybe once or twice have I ever died to Seek, but I, he's cool. I think his sequence is super intense. I think he's fun. I'm gonna put him behind... Um, I, I'm gonna put him behind Screech, but no, 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 he's not Yeehaw. He's not Yeehaw. I'm gonna put him ahead of Rush as my top yes sir. Last but not least is the figure. He's kind of the main evil monster in Roblox doors. I'm just realizing right now I have nobody in the no category, which probably isn't going to change because I I'm definitely not putting him in no. I, I mean, I, I hate to do this. I gotta put the figure number one. Those are my rankings. Let me know if you agree or disagree. Check out my other YouTube channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. And I will see all of you in the next video.